Hi from the beautiful South Island of New Zealand. My name is Stephanie Lambert and I'm winemaker at Amersfield Wine Company. The majestic Pisa mountain range is a stunning backdrop to our vineyard and winery. Our estate comprises of 78 hectares of planted grapes, predominantly Pinot Noir, the quintessential grape variety of Central Otago. But we also have planted Pinot Gris, Sauvignon Blanc and Riesling. At Amersfield, we are committed to quality grape growing and winemaking that is both sustainable and as natural as possible. Now for something special is our Amersfield Pinot Noir. Our hand-picked grapes are de-stemmed with some whole bunch and allowed to cold soak for five days. This helps enhance the colour, which Andre gives us great colour from our grapes. Wherever possible, we let indigenous yeast do the fermentation. We allow seven to 10 days post-fermentation maturation on skins. And when we feel the time's right, we press to French oak barriques, percentage new and old, and we leave this for about 10 months. And in the resulting wine, we see luscious plum with mocha and spice, classic atmosphere characters for our Pinot Noir, with great complexity, seamless velvety tannins, and I'm sure that you will enjoy this world-class Pinot Noir from Amersfield as much as we and the rest of Amersfield enjoyed making it. Hi, I'm Andre Lattigan, viticulturist for Amersfield Vineyard. Uh, I'm originally from Cape Town and have been on Amersfield's Vineyard for the last nine years, have grown with it and um, I'm a responsible person for providing quality fruit for Stephanie to produce this fabulous product. I'm an extremely privileged person to be able to live in the central Otago and uh, be part of uh, this uh, structure and to be able to bring this product to you for your enjoyment. Grown, not made. Growing the all important fruit for this world class pinot that we produce on Amersfield is done on our very free draining uh, gravelly soils, soils with a, uh, a gravel base and uh, essentially a layer of, um, of clay loam on top. Uh, these soils have a very low nutrient and water holding capacity which encourages the vines to send their roots deep down into the soil to assimilate the flinty uh, mineral flavours that we have in uh, central Otago and especially here on Amersfield. Uh, and also, uh, at these latitudes, the uh, lengthening cold nights towards the end of the season help lock in those fabulous flavours. Now for something truly unique to Amersfield, our Rocky Knoll Reserve Pinot Noir. This wine is magnificent. The grapes for this are sourced from our Rocky Knoll, hand tended at all stages, low cropping, low yield to produce fruit that is great concentration. The wine is matured in French oak barriques for up to 18 months. Unfiltered, unfined. It is a wine of great depth, concentration, liquish, mocha, complexity, tannins that are robust, yet velvety and silky. It is a true reflection of Amersfield. It's a world-class wine. That don't you agree, Andre? Absolutely, Steph. It took a lot of growing, but it's pure pleasure. Amersfield Riesling. I love making Riesling. When we make Riesling, we think of delicate aromas. And for this reason, we whole bunch press very slowly with low extraction. We ferment very cool, and this helps capture and enhance these aromatics. In this wine, we see citrus, green apple, with some flinty character, which is classic terroir of Amersfield block. Please enjoy our Riesling. It will last for years.
to our 2008 Pinot Gris. At Amersfield, we have a number of clones from Barry to the more scientifically named 7-8, planted across our estate at the front of the winery and also on the lighter soils on the terraces above the winery. 80% of the blend is whole bunch pressed gently into stainless steel tank. This is then cool fermented with cultured yeast. 20% of our blend is whole bunch pressed straight into 600 litre French oak mouis. These are often wild fermented. This adds complexity and structure to our Pinot Gris. These then stay on leaves post fermentation for up to five months where we batonage or lees stir every two weeks depending on flavour and texture profile. In about October we blend the two components together and we get our resulting wine which we hope shows complexity and structure with great tropical fruit flavours. We see white peach, spicy character from our barrels, ripe pear with a good complexity, acidity and length of flavour. Next I'd like to introduce our Sauvignon Blanc. Here we pick early to get the quintessential New Zealand cool climate Sauvignon Blanc character, the vim and the vigour that is passion fruit, herbaceous character. At Amersfield we add another component, about 5%, where we whole bunch press direct to French oak barriques. So when we blend we have the quintessential New Zealand Sauvignon Blanc, passion fruit, gooseberry with our file cracking yeast and then we have our little bit of body from our barrel component and added complexity and here is our 2009 vintage Sauvignon Blanc.